Hey Virgo, sorry your reading is late. Um, I've just been busy, so I'm gonna get these out today. It is, uh, what is today? August 4th. Um, just here in a, within the next couple of hours. Um, I'm a new channel, so if you haven't subscribed, please do. Um, this is for, you know, persons in separations, so I'm just gonna jump right into it. Um, it's gonna be a little bit different, okay? Uh, all right, so we're gonna get the past history of Virgo and their person. What is the past history of Virgo and their person, please? Who are we speaking to today? Which Virgos out there are we speaking to? History, we have the Empress showing up. So somebody knows somebody's a soulmate. The Four of Pentacles, that is a card I feel like is guarded. And we have the Knight of Wands. All right, so what I'm feeling um, the past history is um, you guys are very passionate about each other. I'm not sure if you're the Knight of Wands or if you are the Empress just yet, Virgo, okay? Um, but somebody has a guarded heart and I'm gonna feel like it's the Knight of Wands energy, um, the Playboy energy, the reason why he has not committed to, he, she has not committed to the Empress energy, okay? So one of you feel like you're dealing with a divine counterpart and the other one is too busy being a play person and protecting their heart because they are afraid of being hurt is what I'm feeling, essentially, all right? The present feelings of the Virgo and their person, please. What are the present feelings? The mutual present feelings of Virgo and their person. If you guys don't like the shuffling, you can fast forward. Almost had one. There's already a lot of major arcana. All right, so, dang. Yeah, Virgo, you are dealing with a um, soulmate and just right out the gate, you have more major arcana on the board than any um, other person. We have the chariot, so the present feelings, um, mutual, is I'm feeling that you both want some sort of forward movement on this situation. Um, I feel like you both are thinking about each other a lot, if not manifesting the situation to come back around, okay? And I feel like you both want it to be balanced and fair, all right? Um, that's Temperance, the Magician, and the Chariot, just in case you guys weren't aware. Um, yeah, so the energy I'm picking up is that you both want this, you both want forward movement, you both are manifesting, you both are thinking about each other, um, you both want balance, you want, you want the situation to be fair, um, but somebody is a little bit too protective right now, okay? So what is Virgo's person current situation? What is their current situation? One more please for Virgo. What is their person's current situation? All right, so I feel like, um, all right, so we have the Three of Cups and um, the feeling I'm getting on this card um, is that it, somebody is with somebody else at the current moment. And I feel like your Knight of Wands is being a queen, a King of Wands to a Queen of Pentacles right now. But this is not their person. It's not. And they, they know that it's not. So I feel like with this right here, um, I f this is you, okay? This is you, you're the Empress. I mean, take it how, if it, if you need to flip it and you're the player, flip it. But you're, I'm gonna tell you, you're the Empress and you're a person, it could be that they're younger than you. Um, and it could be that, you know, that they were just in and out of your life and they um, abused the situation, you know? Um, but I do feel like the person left you, maybe ghosted you for a, another person who is the Queen of Pentacles. And the Queen of Pentacles, they could be just a, a very loving energy, um, but I don't feel like this person is being faithful to them because all they did was turn into a king. Still the same energy from the night. Um, they they still I feel like even with this person they're with they're not they're not being they're not being loyal to this person. The empress, your energy. 
this is you. You're all four queens in one. You're not one queen. You're all four. You got all your shit together. You, um, you are emotionally stable. You're available. You are clear headed. Um, you are uh, financially stable. Um, you speak truth. You know, there is everything about you sitting in that empress. And this is not you, your person, their current situation. And it could be that they were with somebody that you didn't even know about and they had you in third party. Okay. That is what I'm feeling. All right. So we're going to ask, how do they feel about you? Virgo, how does your person feel about you? How does Virgo's person feel about them? How does Virgo's person feel about them? Please show us. That one was a flyer. Okay. I just didn't let it hit back again. All right. We got one more. Virgo. How does your person feel about them? All right. I wasn't going to keep that card because I've only been taking three, but okay. So I feel like what they, um, I feel like, how, how do they feel about you? They, they know that you know that they've been doing something shady and they want to come out of that energy. You know, they want to progress. Okay. They, they know that they owe you an apology for, um, being this type of energy towards you. Okay. Um, that's how they're feeling. They feel like you are not only the empress, but you're also their star. You're their wish fulfillment. You know, they see you, how they feel about you is that you're just somebody who, um, is just hard, hard working in every, every aspect of your life, every area of your life. You have your shit together, right? Um, there is, this person probably um, wonders what, what you see in them, honestly. Um, and they know they've done you wrong, you know? We're going to ask how they feel about reconciliation. For Virgo, how does their person feel about reconciliation? How does their person feel about reconciliation, please? There we go. All right, we have the Ten of Swords, the Six of Swords and the eight of wands. So asking the question, how do they feel about reconciliation? They want to come out of the, um, they want to put that, this situation right here. They want to lay it down. They want to move away from it. They want to close out the non-speaking terms with you and move forward. And this is how they still feel about you. Eight of wands energy. Um, they would definitely reconcile with you. Um, but they also might be wondering what you're thinking. You know, if y'all haven't talked. So we're going to ask, how, what can Virgo do to um, help the situation? If they want their person back, of course, what can they do to help the situation? What can they do to help the situation? Please show us the answers. What can Virgo do to help the situation? There we go. All right, so um, I feel like what the universe is telling you, Virgo, is um, you don't need to do anything. And I'm sorry, I don't read the cards upside down. I feel like there's enough negative energy that we can grasp on, you know. I feel like what the universe is telling you um, is just to hold tight, okay. There's already so many major arcana that this is being divinely, divinely guided. You just need to wait it out, okay. Just wait it out. Just hang tight. Five of Swords is telling you, no, yeah, be conflicted about the situation. Don't rush into it. You don't have to do anything. I feel like this is, they're saying, this is not your fault. You don't need to do anything. This person needs to come to you, okay? But we're working on them, okay? They need to come out of this right here and stop treating people like that. So let us do our work, right? All right, and then we are going to ask, will we reconcile? Virgo and their person person that's on their mind will there be reconciliation Just 
please, thank you. One more, please, and thank you. Thank you. All right, we have the um, Princess of Wands, which, where am I at? Jesus, sorry. So this is about message, message, right? We have the moon, another major arcana, and then we have the king of swords. So will there be reconciliation? I definitely feel like the universe is going to push this person to reach out and it might just be, um, it might just be, you know, it's crickets right now and then it might be, you know, a chirp here, here or there, uh, but they are going to, they're going to push this person to come out and be honest with you and tell you everything that's been going on and tell you the truth. Okay. Um, I do feel like there is the potential for reconciliation. Um, and, but we all have free will, Virgo. So if you move on from this person and you don't want the energy around you no more, you know, we all have free will. I'm going to get some romance angels to see what uh, kind of situation this is, what kind of romance this is. Let's see what they want to tell you. So we do have um, express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. This is them talking to your person, not you. I feel like they're telling you to hang tight, and this one's for you. Trust. This situation is calling you, calling for you to have faith. Okay. And then I'm just gonna get a couple, just a little more messages because I do feel like this is a pretty deep connection, um, even though it may not feel like that right now. Okay. Let's just see. What are the messages for Virgo, please? What else can we, can we take that one? Let's see, what else can we tell them? All right. Rediscover inner child, and I just feel like they're telling you to, you know, that's you. You deserve it, right? Um, loving, compassionate being, that's you. All day long, you're that empress, right? We have ascending together so i do feel like um you both have recognized some sort of activation in each other even if you're not hearing from this person right now okay we have this is being guided by angels and we we know that right because that's why they have trust out karmic relationship we have this because this is what this person is going through right now this is what they have to handle that's what they have to deal with right now and then we have catalyst karmic relationship so it could be too that you have awoken them and then they're going with this karmic so they might just be blinded and think this person is their their um their twin flame right this is somebody who's activating them you know they are activating them in the sense that they they did you wrong um and this person is helping i'm sorry but the karmic is actually helping to awaken them um, you know, when you learn more about that, it, it's super interesting. All right. So Virgo, those are your messages. I will talk to you guys next week. All right. Bye.